A masterpiece that has changed the face of the historical Mulungushi International Conference Center, the Kenneth Kaunda Wing. The $65 million facility with a seating capacity of 2,500 people is all set for the AU Media Coordinating Summit. President Haka Indihichilema has commissioned the facility and is confident of Zambia becoming a regional hub for conferences. We shall take advantage of up upcoming summits to market our world-class world class tourist attractions. We need to get tourists to come to Zambia, and once they come to Zambia, they must stay longer. We will continue to market the many economic opportunities this country offers. And this attraction, this conference center, is part of that group that will allow us to exploit the immense potential. President Hichilema also emphasized the need for standardization of contract signs in order to get value for money from projects, while noting that he is closely watching the quasi-government institutions and councils on their operations. This is the way it should be, to deliver projects of quality and indeed at the right price on a timely basis. We have discussed these issues in cabinet and we agreed that the culture must change. Parastatos, various authorities that sometimes think that they are outside the realm of public sector scrutiny. You are required to stay within the limits of prudence. For the Chinese envoy to Zambia, this structure financed by his government further cements bilateral ties with Zambia. The two countries have always treated each other as equals with respect and have given each other firm support on core interests and major concerns. We have forged a spirit of China-Zambia friendship that shares will and woe, equity and common development, fully taking advantages of history. The contract of this facility, which created over 1,200 jobs, is China Jiangsu International, which has been in Zambia since 1998. It is now looking at diversifying into other sectors. We will keep our commitment and apply the continuous sense of responsibility to maintain the building during the warrant period. We are appealing to the ministry to attach a team that will be working with us closely so that the facility can be properly kept and maintained even after the set period. The Lusaka Province Administration is elated that the KK Wing raises Lusaka's profile, while the Minister of Infrastructure knows that this facility now puts Zambia on the regional footing. I wish to put on record that this facility in commission this afternoon with a capacity of 2,500 sitting capacity is one of the largest conferences center in sub-Saharan Africa. The new conference center is a tool that will be used to market Lusaka City, Lusaka Province, and the nation at large in the tourism and business sector. The Kenneth Kaunda Wing, whose construction works started two years ago, is set to host the AU Media Coordinating Summit slated for July 2nd this year. President Hichile Malay dignitaries to plant a permanent mark here. Brian Moale, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and subscribe.